just fed Storm. And our new boy, right here, is all growly and puffy after me feeding Storm. Yeah, Mr. Puffy. Let's see if I can get a better view. What? He's hungry. He's a hungry boy, huh? Ooh, huff and puff. Huff and puff. Are you a hungry man? Stormy's busy. So, you and I are going to you and I are going to Bosque del Apache this weekend, boy. We'll be there all weekend. <clears throat> yeah. What else? Got anything else to say? What about that guy? He's just racing around. He's hungry. He's hungry. <laughs> yeah, you tell him. You tell him, handsome. Well, I never get tired of looking at this. <laughs> Look at that. That's a wolf eating a big old chunk of meat. What it is, it's a frozen loaf of elk meat. They loaf it up. It's about uh, four pounds. Ray, do you copy? Sorry. And, uh... They love it. Not all the wolves love it, though. Some wolves actually will prefer the domestic meats over the wild game. Wild game's pretty rich. Oh, honey. Oh, honey. What's up, baby? Oh, talk to us. Tell us stuff. Brian, were you calling me? Those are radio calls you're hearing in the background. All of our... Uh, Staff and volunteers carry radios because the sanctuary is so huge. We're like 120 acres, a little more. And so we're spread out. All righty. I'll talk to you later, little boy. Amber's coming to feed you.